morning, everyone. Welcome to your Ranger News. Everything from sports to clubs. To interviews. I'm John Taylor. I'm Tatum Fauche. And I'm Maximus LaRosa. Spencerport History Club is hosting a decade stance on January 17th in the West Cafeteria. It is from 7.30 to 10, and tickets are available for purchase in the Cub House for $10 and for $12 at the door, dressed in 70s, 80s, and 90s outfits. Attention all seniors. The photographer will be here one last time for your cap and gown picture on Tuesday, January 14th, starting at 7.25 a.m. through advisement in the green room. Please see Mrs. Hill in the main office with any questions. Attention all Model United Nation members. We'll be meeting today in room 142 during activity period to plan for an upcoming meeting with St. John Fisher. New members are always welcome. Attention seniors, staff, superlatives are out. Visit Rangers Yearbook on Twitter by the end of the day to vote. There will be a Best Buddies meeting today in room 326B. Hope to see you there. And now for our 12 on 1 transition highlight of the week. We had two Spenceport graduates, Timothy DeMonte and Max Miller, visit our transition classroom this week to share information about project search such as transportation and career options after school. If you need one more pig credit, please donate to one of the following to the Open Door Mission. Another way to earn one more pig credit would be to donate to the Embracing Options charity by January 16th to one of the following. On Sunday, February 16th, from 1 to 5 p.m., there is a great giveaway happening called Anna's Angels Formal Dress Giveaway at Serenity Hair Salon at 38 Slayton Ave. The event is completely free and there is no limit to the number of dresses. All dresses were received as donations to be used at the event in loving memory of Anna Maria Accorso. Now over to Jeremy with the Ranger weather. Good morning everyone. Today's high is forecasted to be in the middle to upper 40s with rain showers at times. I think it is safe to say that we will get mostly rain out of this next system tomorrow. Highs will soar to near 60 degrees on Saturday. Rain will be on the order of 1 to 2 inches and heavy at times into Sunday. Saturday night features rain with some models still depicting a decent amount of freezing rain Saturday night. However, viewing the recent trends, this is unlikely. unlikely. Sunday, as the storm departs, wind will, winds will gust up to 55 and even 60 miles an hour. As for the real winter weather, starting in one to two weeks, we will get some real snow and cold. Until then, stay tuned and have a weathertastic day. And now, back to the news desk. Thanks, Jeremy. And we now have a special message from our Sources of Strength crew. Hi, I'm Anna. I'm Claire. And I'm Liv. We're in a club called Sources of Strength. Our mission is to help students and staff turn to their strength and supports that are all around. We ensure that during rough times, no one gets so overwhelmed or hopeless that they want to give up. When it all feels a little too much, I like to take my dog for a walk. When I feel overwhelmed, I make an attack plan against my problems. Then before I start, I like to meditate for 10 minutes. When I'm stressed, I listen to music and surround myself with close friends. It's important that during the winter months, we find ways to keep mentally and physically active so stress doesn't get the best of us. Listen for future announcements and events from Sources of Strength. Now, now back, back to, to the, the Ranger, Ranger News Desk. <laughs> Thanks, crew. And that's all for today, Rangers. Stay tuned for next week's Ranger News and have a great weekend. And remember, a new year is a chance for new beginnings. <laughs>